The standard. Let's do it. This is Admiral Carius. Surrender control of your ship. Lucifer's a mining planet. Why are the Imperials taking us there? Vader seeks the bright star. He must not succeed. Corvax? Creepy guy said you're a descendant of Lady Corvax. She stole the bright star, believing it would restore her husband to life. It reduced our world to the wasteland you see now. You were a means to an end, but now you have outlived your usefulness. A word of advice. Do not anger Vader. May the sleeper guide your spirit along the river of stars. Veda won't waste any time activating the Eon Engine. When he does, he will destroy what little life still clings to our planet. Only you can face Veda. Our only hope is to attack his castle. Wait, 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 wait. You want us to take on his entire garrison? We need an army for that. You have an army. As Lady Kovac's descendant, you can command the Horde in battle. Even now, they await you in the necropolis above. Uh, unless you can magic us up some wings. Can't really see how we're gonna make it all the way back to Vader's castle. Perhaps we can restore that ancient air skiff. What air skiff, bug eyes? Ah, oh, that air skiff. Right. Unfortunately, we lack the necessary tools. Step aside, crazy pants. If I can fix a hyperdrive, I'm sure I can repair this. Whatever it is. Follow me. Go on. We got this. Well, I got this. Anyway. <sighs> okay. Hey, everybody. Welcome back. My name is Gummy Worm Jim. It's Vader Immortal. We're still below the surface of Mustafar. Four-armed uh, Rancor was a bit of an issue, but as you can see, it seems like the uh, people of this planet knew that that was going to be a thing. Hi. This platform is designed to lift us to the necropolis. However, it is not functioning. Its source of power is energy crystals. These can only be set in place by one of Korvac's blood. I'm of Korvac's blood, apparently. I see. That's not supposed to be there, that's broken crystal. Let's go grab this one as well. in there. Okay. This, this is very intuitive this time. Using the force properly is a nice feeling. That's great. They managed to physically capture what it feels like to be a little bit more force adept, you which is will great need to find as the game progresses. This one goes over here. Like so? 
well done. <laughs> All right. Ah, <sighs> going up. <laughs> I like that your head piece has the the bright star in it. That's your robes. Radar will take the bright star to his chambers and activate the Eon engine. But if we hurry, we may yet stop him. I know you did not choose this path, but our future depends on you. That's the way it always works, I guess. My people will do what we can, and I have someone that know that to aid us in our struggle. Okay. What do we do? Ooh. This is lovely. So Hello. The necropolis. We are here. The marching horde awaits us. Sure. Let's get right in there, I guess. There they are. Lady Kovac's matching horde is legion. Yeah, I've noticed these guys. Your light sword can command them, and there is one who still knows how. Yeah? Whoa. Lord Kovac, thank you for heeding my call. Veda now possesses the bright star. How will you stop him from activating the Eon engine? Perhaps we can destroy it. And destroy the bright star along with it. If we shatter the bright star, the life current will be free to flow through Mustafa. But first, we must reach Veda. We need the marching horde. With the horde at our side, my tribesmen can engage Veda's troops. In order to awaken the Horde, you must make the signals of authority with your light sword. Okay. What are the signals of authority? Step forward and take your rightful position of Corvaxian command. Okay. Grandpa, I guess. Weird. Use the light sword to follow my actions. Okay. Stroke upwards, left to right, then straight downwards. The horde is responding. That was cool. Now, a second gesture. Tell me some more. This time, a three pointed shape, a tribute to the three favors. Good friend series of gestures. Sweep your light sword upwards to finish in the position of command. <laughs> okay, but that's like an ass. Watch out, that shit. It is done. Nice. They now recognize you as their master. That's sick. Only you have the power to stop Vader. Your strength will be tested, but we will help where we can. Okay. The chamber opens. Stormtroopers, use your lights to direct the horde against them. Right. 
Oh, I almost was that Okay. Oh, you got it working. Wow. Are all those droids on our side now? The board is under your captain's command. But if we are to stop Vader, we must now transfer that command to me. I will lead them in our assault on the garrison. Touch your light soul to my staff. Oh, he's dead? Captain, we can't cram that whole blanket army onto this sketch. Get it. Thank you. <laughs> Take the magic. <laughs> Would have been nice to have our own horde. Bum on it left. Uh, you know, Warnet really will take you to Vader's castle. I will follow with the horde. Gotcha. How about this time I'm the pilot of this rust bucket? Hmm? My servos can't take any more of your piloting. Or whatever it is that you're calling it. Just don't make me sick. You guard us well. My horde, my minions. Obey the Elder. Later, Clungers! We will see Hello. you in the battlefield or whatever. I have no idea where we've been going. I do appreciate how smooth you're keeping us, though. Uh, Wanik, got any lights on this thing? Oh, no. Oh, gosh. Okay. Ancient lava flows formed a network of conduits. My tribesmen mapped them out centuries ago. Without my guidance, a soul could be lost down here forever. Presuming any soul in their right mind would want to come down here. I wish that I had my fan on every- Hey! Pull that thing over! Bring it! Oh no! Power down your vehicle and surrender your weapon. Come on, shoot. Attack! We need reinforcements! Don't go any faster! Go. Why not? You'll have to deal with the true boys. We can't outrun them. Got it. Can you use the force? Come on. Hitting you. Come on. Cut them down. Ready for you. You're doing great, Captain. He bad early on. Stop him. Oh, 
You got me a couple times, but I'm alright. Fire on the ah! Ow. Just hurt. Got him all. Thanks, Captain. It's quite Hey, Wadi. About your icons. So, what do you have for poor eyesight? They are for protection and the style. Oh. Right. Okay then. Believe it. Daylight. Or lava light. What is it? Whoa. What's going on at the top of Vader's castle? Something not good. Man, we're literally glitching. We must hurry. Alright, let's do this. Three of us and an elder and like a small I army. The hangar will be open. You'll have to find a way to override the controls to let the horde inside. Okay, Wani, you got your ride back. Just don't try any fancy flying until we're off. Come on. Good luck, my friends. The fate of the galaxy rests in your hands. Good luck to you too. No pressure, bug eye. But seriously, be careful. What did I just tell them about fancy flying? Oh, if Wanik doesn't crash that thing, I'd be amazed. It's pretty cool though. This is. This is a Star Wars hallway if I've ever seen it. <laughs> oh, it's so cool. God, this set design is beautiful. Okay. What am I supposed to do here? Huh. Oh, wait. <laughs> the force, you know? What good can I do? Again. I wasn't sure if we were ever going to see it again. What are we doing, though? We've got to find a way to get our army into the hangar. See if you can activate that control panel right in front of you. Um, I don't like that. Okay, opening. Try to find a movie. That is what that did. The hangar door should open to let the TIE fighter out. See if you can get it to launch. Uh. Keep going, Captain. Try one of the other controls. Okay, I want it to go. Press the buttons next to the arrows. Yeah, but that's not that's not exactly discreet. Oh, they're gonna notice us, yo. Hey, but we got the hangar open. Hey, and there's our army! Cool. Well, we might actually have a chance now. That'll keep the bucket heads busy. 
Okay, no time to watch you. We should get going to the elevator. Awesome. Go. Go into the robot army. Let's go. Come on, let's head to the elevator. <laughs> I warned Lord Vader you couldn't be trusted. <laughs> I thought that was against like a prime directive that, or something, but maybe that's not a, that's you a different lead the universe. Way and be ready for trouble. 